this, I'm going to show you a really, really good recipe that I'm going to make with crescent rolls, with sausage, eggs, pepper, and cheese. Okay, what I'm going to do here is I've got four eggs, just a little bit of milk, some salt to taste, some pepper to taste, and I'm going to go ahead and whisk that up really, really well. I turn my heat on low and I'm going to spray my pan really, really well. And then I'm going to add the egg and I'm going to kind of slow cook that. I want fluffy eggs. In the meantime, we're going to go ahead and put the croissant rolls on the pan. Okay, I've got my croissant rolls here and I'm going to take them out. And there's a little seam right here, so we're going to open it up by that. And we're going to just unroll that. And there's a little seam there. And we're going to unroll those. And what you want to do is you want to take and make a star out of the croissants with the point facing out. You want to overlap each piece. So first I'm going to make the cross. Like that. And then I'm going to make another cross to fill in the blanks. So, like this. that sausage over there. It smells really, really good too. Okay. Almost done. Like that. Okay. Doing now is I've got some cheddar cheese and I'm going to mix some mozzarella in with that. About the same amount. I love cheese though. I'm going to mix that up together in the bowl. Because I, you can use any kind of cheese that you like. Um, I just happen to have these on hand, so that's what we're gonna do. My sausage is almost done. Let me stir my eggs. I'm turn my sausage off because it'll finish cooking with what's left there. Oh yeah, this looks really good. Now what I'm going to do with the cheese is I'm going to take it and I'm going to go in a little circle around the inside of the croissant ring, star, whatever you want to call it, just like that. Frozen bell peppers, I'm going to go ahead and chop those up. I don't want too many, just enough to give it a little bit of sweet flavor of pepper. Done, and I'm going to put it out on my paper towel to let it drain the grease out of it. And this is how you want it to look. Now you can very well do this with bacon, country ham, uh, ham, you know, any kind of meat, roast beef, if you like roast beef with your eggs, uh, anything like that. We just happen to have sausage, so we're going to do it with sausage today, but I'm going to let it drain, get all that extra grease out of there, and then we'll start assembly. I went ahead and stuck my bell peppers in the hot grease. I'm going to cook them just a little bit so that um, they will soften up and they're not going to be frozen anymore. And then I'll take those out and drain those as well. Okay, now I'm going to go ahead and cut up my sausage. On, I'm going to place my sausage on the croissant. I almost forgot to mention 
Preheat your oven to 375. Next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put the egg on top of the cheese. Now it's going to be hot, so just be careful. Now we're going to take the bell peppers and we're just going to place them on top of the egg. You can definitely put raw bell pepper on here. Um, I like mine cooked just because it gives it a little bit of a different flavor. Um, but you can very well put raw bell pepper on there. Okay, now I'm going to put the rest of the cheese on top. I told you I like a lot of cheese. Okay. Then we're going to take each star piece and we're going to fold it over into the center as well as you can because they're not all the same. Some of mine are different sizes. Right into the center. it in the oven 375 for about 20 minutes and then we'll check it out and see what it looks like okay it's done let it sit for a couple minutes I'm gonna put it over onto the plate and let it sit for just another couple minutes so that I can actually eat it okay it's time to cut into this Really easy to cut. Wow, look at that. That looks so good. Put that on the plate. Let's give it a try. Alright, now let's give it a try. Oh my god, that's so good. Mmm. This is delicious. You need to try this at home. You can use bacon, country ham, Talking with my mouth full. This is so good. You need to try it.